me out. Hey, yo, red, my name is Pink. I made him go get that ink. Let him eat that pretty pussy. Now he keep trying to link. I I'm pimping Pinky Ring. His ex is a Smanky Dink. I'm about to pop a thingy, then sip on that shinky drink. Get the grip, but my pick is dip. Eat it with my tip. I'm a flip, like a hundred grip. Get back on my lip. I'm a bitch. I want fish and quick. Don't want hissy fit. I'm talking about chicken when I jerk it with my tip. I be twerking on it too. Cause I'm slurping that beat too. When I find it, choke his neck on me. Shouldn't be doing it. Chichi's here now, I see you. Welcome to my life. Hey, Chichi, it's your girl Kotachi. Another week, another prank. Another week, another. Right. Today is Sunday. It's 9 3 a.m. and I'm ready for school, as you can see. And I'm even kind of late because it's already 9 and class that's a 9. And I don't want to get hungry in class. So I have some food here. It's from yesterday. I microwaved it. I'm coming to eat it like real quick. It's rice and beef sauce. I got it from Bolt's Food. I'm so, so hungry. I don't know. This morning, like, I'm hungry. But after class, I think I want to make angoma. I don't know if it's possible. But we're going to see after class. See you guys when I get to school. I look horrible. We're on our way to school, guys. I want to listen to some DeVito. DeVito. Guys, DeVito is like my fave, like favorite. He has charisma. He is, wow, I didn't say I want to listen to the, that's her biggest jam, not mine. <laughs> okay, guys, I'll see you guys in school. <laughs> So I'm in school right now. It's 9.36. I go to school in 36 minutes time, which is like good. It's not bad, bad, bad. And apparently the lecture just came in, so not so bad. So I'll see you guys when school is over or when I see Habiba. Hey guys, good afternoon. It's 1.24. Hey, see, I was in class and my this thing was so good, so yeah. 124. I didn't even get to see Habiba. You know, she closed earlier than I did. Ah! I'm going to East Ligon right now to go and get their stuff for the Anguamo. I still want to make it. We had a presentation in class today. Again? No, it wasn't like a presentation. It was like, uh, they said like we should observe website, we should enter websites into like those websites greatest and then see how, look at their performance and like their SEO and those things, right? And my God, so that we have to come and explain our analysis and all that, right? Like they give us like 20 minutes to do that for each group. And then I'm the one that talked. <laughs> Because I wanted to make up for the girl talking yesterday. They did a uh, group work and she was the only one that came to school out of the group And she was the only one that spoke so like I felt really really bad So I was like see I have to, today. I have to say something otherwise the lecture will say this girl She's not serious. She's not serious. Like I was so nervous. I was so scared But today we had a podium. I think that helped me. I don't know It was like a support system for me I kept looking at it and then looking at the wall behind everyone. I wasn't even having any eye contact with anyone I was just talking but I think overall I did better today than the last time I can't say if I did like 100 but then my group member was like oh like I actually did well and then you guys they clap for me I feel like they clap for me because they know how nervous I am usually and then it's like today I did a little better so like they're like oh <laughs> I'm gonna see when we get to the store okay whenever I prepare Anguamu you guys always ask me where I get the beef from. I'll show you guys the location, okay? Please people ask me on Snapchat all the time. Even when I post on TikTok, you guys are like always asking me. So I'm gonna show you guys where it's at, okay? It's the same place that I bought the, the local ingredients from in the vlog that I posted yesterday, right? So we are almost there, Seth, right? We are almost there. I've never eaten angamo from you before. <laughs> <laughs> That hard rice that you made. Hey, 
you made some hard I, right don't I, like please, even yeah, if you speak. defend yourself cry your voice won't come inside so don't even worry don't even try it. you yeah, guys he see. makes the worst nangomu in the world mm -hmm. <laughs> this is easily gone hi hi i'm back again hi. guys the place is called jehovah is my helper and it is opposite they sell fuel and things hi please i want um beef do you guys have beef i want four or five and then tomatoes and then give me plantain thank you and then give me um plantain the ripe one the one in the middle Oh, sorry, sorry. And should I buy garlic? Garlic, no more on your infant ship. Sack, kakra, come. Do you have one that is like taken out? Yeah. Give me one title sardine. I think that that's all. I'll pay with Momo. You accept Momo, right? I don't buy the eggs from here. The last time was Thank you. How much is everything? 101. Okay. I have to buy eggs, rice, and then. Do you have avocado? You don't have okay. Thank you. I'm going to ANC to get the rest of the stuff. I need eggs, rice, and oil. We have the ANC more. Let me take my bag. Oh god. No, that's it's alright. I'm fine. Thank you. Hi. I'm so tempted to buy granola guys but I'm here for just three things if I buy granola I'm going to abuse it <laughs> really oh my god say hi for him for me <laughs> all right oh she said her husband likes me oh hi and someone said that your mom is a chi chi oh, Guys, Dimes has a can drink. I never knew. I'm gonna try this. I gotta try it. So long as it's Dimes. Any of you mango? Okay. Let's take the mango. Guys, right now I don't even know what to take. Let me take the you know me, the sunflower. This is the oil I know, so I'm gonna take. I don't think they have Gino. So I'm gonna take the lily. Hi, I want one of the chocolate croissants. Is this filled with something or it's plain? Chocolate one. And then this is plain. Give me one plain, one chocolate. I was this. Coconut cookies. This as well. Hi. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. I think they are on triple. It was my birthday. I went somewhere. That video was filmed like two weeks ago. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. <laughs> people are so nice. Like. People are just so nice. Today I met a bajillion chichis, guys. It's insane. <laughs> guys, I didn't get the avocado, but I just saw a stand that's selling some, so we're gonna buy from them. Hello. Ma, good afternoon. Pacha Oji Momo. Okay, okay. Pacha Meta Avocado. Okay. Pacha Meta Avocado. Nia Bria meet me. The end of the coach. Okay, thank you. Yeah, to Okay, me pay. Near which of near BBI? Me da si pacha yesing. Okay. Pacha number ni yesing. Pacha. Me da si. All right, ma me da si. Thank you. 
Mommy that's you, period. <laughs> Mommy, Chichi's here that was you. Mommy, me and my Chichi's, we thank you. <laughs> please, do you have straw? Yes. Okay, please, I want one. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I want one with plenty water, okay. okay. Thank you. What does it? Oh. That doesn't make a hospital. Four years. Thank you, okay. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> let's go home guys guys so i'm back home it's 3 41 p.m and honestly i'm too tired to cook but let me give you guys a quick haul of everything that i got i mean it's like miscellaneous very unnecessary but i just want to give you guys a haul whether i like it or not i got food on the way i was really craving the rice and the stew and then the salad i don't know what it's called but i think it has a name like that whole vibe sometimes they put in leaves but i don't really like the smell of the leaves so i always take it in pack it's a new place that i've never eaten from before so at the local place i got some plantains let me keep them up where i keep my plantains one second guys tomatoes and i got garlic because my dad adds garlic to like pepper and it's so good like it makes it so flavorful and I got Taito sardine. Guys, they have the perfect beef in Ghana. Perfect beef for Ngongo. They sell the perfect beef. You guys should go there and buy from them for real. Perfect color, perfect everything. Trust me, I know that it's not the natural color, but it gives the food flavor. It makes the food look good, like appealing. And you know that I'm all for garnishing, so. We got avocado, but this avocado, dear. Hey, ma. This one's supposed to be for tomorrow. So you know what, I think I'm going to cut this on the food today. Otherwise, this one, the way it's soft, it will spoil by tomorrow. And when we went to a and C, I I got dimes. I told you guys that I really, really like dimes. So when I saw that they have canned drinks too, I decided to get it. And they have this flavor as well. I got oil. And they don't have Gino rice, so I got Lily. Lily is my second favorite rice. And I got eggs because... I didn't like the way yesterday's eggs were better and I had to wash them. The pastry area, I got, um, I don't want to touch it, but I got some plain and then chocolate filled croissant. Guys, this is supposed to be the food. Oh lord, I big. But I have my salad to here this salad i've had it for like a couple of days but it's still fresh if it's not looking good i'm just going to add salad but hopefully it tastes good oh look at what is going on on the food interesting you know what scares me the most about buying these type of foods usually the rice is like cheap rice and it doesn't taste like nice maybe like overall it's gonna hit i forgot my avocado now this is a lot of food like this is a lot like a whole goddamn lot i hope my salad like the one that i added is not tasting like trash right now and it's not going to spoil my food you're not supposed to smell food before you eat it, but for health sake, please, guys. I like Frankie's better, but it's not bad, to be honest. If you have places that you can recommend for this type of food, please recommend for me because I really, really like it. It's just that I don't have like a staple place that I can get this type of food because I really, really like this like whole combination. Guys, am I the only one that's falling out of love with Slim Fit? I've always <clears throat> liked Vortec, okay? I really came to like Slim Fit, but it's starting to develop taste for me. You know, Vortec tastes like nothing, right? And because I drink my water 
warm i don't like cold water so i'm able to like really taste the water no water drinkers drink it room temperature we are able to tell if the water is trash or the water is good and honestly speaking i'm thinking the water is starting to become trash or like just let me know because slim fit is starting to get taste like it never ever used to be like this i don't know okay guys i'll talk to you later It's 4.35 p.m. on a Tuesday. Yesterday, I didn't cook the food like I said I would because <sighs> I was really so tired. I feel like you guys are tired of hearing me say that I'm tired. And Mondays are like my rest days because, you know, I've started school and things. I don't rest on Sundays and I don't rest on Saturdays and I don't really rest on Fridays because I post on Saturdays on YouTube. Yeah, I have here some indomie and some egg that i fried i'm about to eat that i'm watching alia's face right now i posted on twitter that i was looking for a manager and i totally forgot that i mean i still receive emails so even today i received an email plenty of it i'll show you guys in a minute totally 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 forgot to respond to those emails i actually have to go through them and see which ones look attractive like i need a very professional person somebody that will also pitch me to brands even though sometimes brands also come to me like i don't know if like i'm ready for this but i think i kind of am i'm slowly getting comfortable so i feel like i'm kind of ready i don't know i've not been here for long so you know like i'm not well versed in this type of business do you get what i'm saying so like i need somebody that will explain it to me and you know like tell me how it goes how it's done and all that i've tried to reply like brands before i don't know how to do it guys that was like the beginning of my <laughs> social media career like i stopped because i feel like i didn't know what to say i just i didn't know what to do like how to go about it jibab so now i receive tons of emails so now i get tons of emails from brands and i'm not able to respond because i don't know what to say I need somebody to show me what to do and like to manage my brand I guess for me because <laughs> I honestly don't know what to say like I can only do the content creation and like that's what I'm good at I just don't know the right things to say like what I'm even supposed to be charging you know and like with my numbers I don't know how much I should be charging you know I'll show you guys the number of emails <laughs> guys look Management deal manager manager advertising requirements manager 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 brand manager <laughs> Wait, it's like you guys can see manager manager Virtual assistance proposal manager recommendation manager manager application manager. Oh, so it looks like um, people who weren't even People who aren't even managers themselves were recommending other people. Okay. Okay. It's paid with collaboration and plenty things like I even got some TikTok deal with some movie production something something in London and I think I was supposed to fly there da, 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 and that they are going to pay for the um, trip and I didn't respond and they kept sending emails and you know that one I know when the email is real because you just have to check the email itself if it's at TikTok.com and a whole lot guys <laughs> and i don't respond for real i remember sometime i even got some billy eilish one to guys like i've been really like slacking and missing out on a whole lot but i'm sure right now those deals have expired because i think it was about some hair album something something <laughs> thank you guys the um, pr collaboration with the uh, whiskey's hair what <laughs> Asteria or something, baby. Guys, 
there are lots like i need to take time to read through every single person's email and then see which ones i'm going to respond and which ones i'm not and i also want like a somebody that's already experienced that won't use me as sample to start their career like i want somebody that already knows what they are doing do you get me so that like yeah i'll not stress and things because i just want to be a baby girl and then the person should just handle the business part of it i'll just create the content not that i would jam my eye or anything but i don't want to bother myself with this kind of stuff to be honest like that's what i'm trying to like avoid let me eat my food and read through some of these emails and watch alia's face and mm -hmm, guys the way alia has been writing her dates guys watch these seeds at the bottom left here on this kind of it's so pretty and it's so simple and it's so minimal. Like I'm gonna be doing the same thing. I can't believe I almost forgot this part. When we went to ANC, the drinks that I got, the dimes. Oh my god, guys, it's so good. Oh my god, I need to run to ANC again. I even posted it on Snap. I was like, oh my god, you guys, run to ANC more right, right, freaking fucking now. And then when we would do screenshots, hopefully when I go there, some will still even be available because damn. Guess what this is? This is the Kylie fragrance. Finally opening it. See how it looks? It's so so pretty. Yay! Cosmic perfume. And it looks like they dashed me some. Guys, this thing has been here for the longest time, so that's why it's deteriorating but yeah they give me toner they dash me a toner and they added the cosmic fragrance sticker oh my god okay this is like the sample it smells so fucking good wait i need to turn the camera around i knew that it would smell nice because everybody was saying that it smells good but i didn't think that it's gonna eat like this and the packaging too is so cute oh my god i want you guys to smell it with me right now i'm not even exaggerating i think this is the best fragrance i have right now because i'm a very fruity and sweet girl with a little bit of mask and this is perfect this is like lick me eat me vibes i'm not even exaggerating i look horrible oh my god <laughs> let me put some lip gloss on what I mean, still, but we'll take this like that. This is the vibe. Da da! Boom, 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 boom. Seed ah! packaging. Oh my lord, this just looks so good. Damn. Wait, it's hitting me with alcohol. Hold on, hold on. I hope it, maybe because it's a lot, you see, so. And I'm sure what they put in here is the oil concentration, otherwise it would have been gone by now but this smells really good and i'm sure it's the same thing so wait it's stronger here people are like it smells nice but there were bad reviews too but it's not bad to be honest even if it doesn't smell nice in the end i feel like sometimes too, you know sometimes the fragrances right like they don't smell nice for you in the beginning but then in the end like they kind of come together like you know you start liking it at some point one day you spray it and you're like oh my god i think i'm falling in love with this fragrance and the bottle gives so even if it's not nice guys it will be nice for decor and adding it to my collection period it smells really really nice not gonna cap guys not gonna cap <clears throat> mm -hmm. i've not smelled anything like this before 
but I feel like it was more fruity here than it is here and I would have liked it to smell exactly like this have we been scammed first of all how much was even this I forgot and I bought it like months ago guys as soon as it came out actually okay so the 100 ml was 78 dollars which is this one this is the vibes it's giving right now see it's nice it's very nice let's go and make room for it that's where I keep my fragrances and see what it looks like you guys see that it's full so i don't know so should i like keep it here instead should i bring my this fragrance here and then keep it here yeah good wait this can even still fit here if i Mm-hmm. It has fit. I know the hair what. I know the hair what. I know the hair what. In Speed Darlington's voice. <laughs> you should be laughing by now if you watched last week's vlog. And here is the Coco Yam. Guys. Okay. After I did myself dirty the last time, I know they hear what. See, I'm going to buy the cocoyam. I think they didn't have it in this size. So, I've made the boldest decision, the scariest decision. Having so much food around is dangerous. You know, especially like a snack to munch on. It's, what's this? It's very... It's very very dangerous but hey hey I'm only human you know I'm only human guys I'm about to go make the anguamo and I got a few stuff and oh my god one sec guys I brought it here so that I could show it to you the Kylie perfume the cosmic perfume I love it yesterday it just needed to settle in and like you know work with my body and all that guys I sprayed it on my wrist and <clears throat> when I was working on the laptop I kept smelling my hand I kept I'm like oh my god this actually smells so so good it just needs time to like marinate you know so I like it so much yesterday my reaction was like really really bad but I like it so so much like honestly and the bottle is so so cute like it's honestly i think it's safe to say that it's my cutest fragrance bottle like ladies and gentlemen her period so because i'm over the slim fits water situation i went to buy some voltic i also got some tissue to refill my tissue boxes and things and the one in the washroom because it's all done it's 3 42 on a Wednesday, by the way. Guys, I broke this one, so it looks like I have to buy a new one. Okay, so I look like a tennis player right now. Serena Williams. Mm-hmm. And I got some stuff too. Guys, I got extra of the drink that I like so much, the Dines. I got two and what else did I get? Obviously, molds. I got some carrots and other stuff. Let me take it to the kitchen 
and show you everything everything and let's start cooking well i'm coming guys i'm gonna speak in a minute I got some carrots because I want to add some, you know, color to the food. Otherwise, it will be boring. And I also got some bell peppers. And you guys know that I don't like sausages, but I just want to add it to this recipe. The beef cracks frozen in the fridge, so we need to remove it. I got too many holes But they ain't you Put that shit in your nose I still love you Doing shit that nobody knows And there's things they be thinking of
You went out my, my general extra small. It sounds correct. Guys, wait, it's extra small girl or like extra in my me. Me. Oh stress me. Oh oh it's you or them. Oh stress me. Okay, so if I want to say something is stressing me, I'll say it's stressing me. Don't lie. Guys, you are learning ga. <laughs> so I'm done cooking and everything. But I want to plate it for TikTok because I didn't film the cooking for TikTok. You guys saw the cooking part, so the plating part, I don't think you guys will care so much, trust me. But I've like put everything in a very cute bowl. The bowls that I got from Amazon, they look so, so good. Let me show you guys. What? Oh my God, they look so cute. And I still have some pepper inside my Asanka. Oh my God, so pretty. Look at my Kelly Lily, my pepper, my eggs my vegetables my corned beef it looks so beautiful we taste it together if the food hits or oh, it was a mess today oh and i forgot that i have avocado here too oh and i also forgot to show you guys that there's also sardine look at how good it looks oh my god looks so good obviously i can't eat everything i'm even about to dish some out before i eat but it looks so delicious. This is like fully loaded anguama. This is insane. Okay. The beef is so good. I buy my beef from that place. I think I've showed you guys in the previous clip. It's so good. Speaking to you guys since morning. I don't know if this week I'm going to even post this vlog because I feel like we don't have much content. But if I don't post, you guys will be on my neck, so I'm going to post it regardless. You guys said that even if it's 11 minutes, I should post it. So yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing. I told you guys that I was going to go through the emails for the manager situation. I saw that Echichi sent me a whole ass message for my birthday. Like I was so shocked. Like, I've not been able to completely go through all of them. But a few that I went through, I saw that she, she sent me a message, a very, very sweet message. Let me read it to you guys. So, her name is Kezia Jackson, okay? She said that, happy birthday to you, my favorite YouTuber. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, she said that, happy birthday to the most creative YouTuber with, like, heart emojis. Keep inspiring us with your amazing content with heart eyes. 
<laughs> wishing you a happy birthday filled with lots of views likes and positive comments with like the proper um the party popper thing emoji and she said that keep being awesome and making a difference i love you so so much with heart emojis and then she said 18 year old me wishes she could buy you a big gift oh don't buy me anything stop <laughs> and then with like the um oh my god what's the animal called the one with the sad eyes with the hamster kind of face yeah that one and then she said but don't worry i promise to buy you a big gift when i grow up <laughs> with the hand on the mouth and heart emojis and like that emoji that's blushing right she said i sent you a birthday message on ig in case you don't see it you can read this one with a heart emoji and she added oh my god like this is like the sweetest thing ever i promise like what this birthday message won. I'm sorry, like it won. I see you guys. I didn't officially even thank you guys for all your birthday wishes. Thank you so so much, honestly. Like I'm so grateful that I'm so loved. Like you guys are literally you. You guys don't even know me from Adam for real. And you show me so so much love, so much love. Like on the internet, guys. Like it sometimes it shocks me. I'm like, oh my god. Like I have a whole family of chichis that love me that will stand up for me that will do anything for me like i'm so so grateful that i have you guys that like i'm i don't have a lot of friends in real life right so like me documenting my life and you guys engaging and like it's so overwhelming in like such a good way like it's so like it's so amazing to me to be honest and honestly i don't know how else i can thank you guys like i love you so so much like that's literally the best way i can put you guys are my best friends for real like you guys are my everything i'm telling you because i don't have my parents here you know like my mom is not here and all that like the way you guys check up on me when i've not even posted in a minute like it's insane what like what what like i love you guys so so much the birthday messages and they were a lot if i said i was going to read through them especially snapchat snapchat's like over a thousand messages i'm telling you guys <laughs> instagram dms you know it's i barely go through like instagram dms or twitter dms or like web i barely go through dms tiktok dms because if i try to go through them i mean sometimes i do go through them don't get me wrong i don't know i don't have like a particular reason i don't know i just don't find myself going through messages like that to be honest the place that i really check sometimes like i pay a little bit more attention to is my email but i know crown not like guys i stay off social media even though i do social media that's insane right like i stay off it i don't go there i don't go there <laughs> maybe tiktok yeah i stay on tiktok and i repost a lot but then apart from that i stay off social media like i don't care sometimes when i open twitter and i see that oh something is going on and i'm like oh I am, I'm barely on Twitter too. Barely. Like, <laughs> because Twitter scares me. It's like the scariest app ever to me. Like, I don't play the. Nah, bruh. I don't like Twitter at all. So, yeah, guys, that's what I wanted to talk to you guys about. Uh, you guys are like the sweetest people ever. And I love you so, so much. And I love you so much, Kezia Jackson. And this is the sweetest message ever. Like, seriously. Ever. <laughs> It's also right i want to start oil pooling and i need those coco those big ass coconut um oil containers like the kirkland one it's big you guys know what i'm talking about the kirkland one i want some i've been looking for some everywhere i went to the Katy's place the last time that i went there i asked if they had but they said they don't have because i want to like start taking very good care of my teeth because i saw that on tiktok like that um oil pooling really really helps so that's what i want to do now I also want to do ear irrigation guys i've never ever done ear irrigation before i heard that it's very very helpful like it actually cleans your ear the proper way maybe next week we're going to go to an ear hospital so that we go and like do the irrigation and can you believe that i have these gems i've had them for like months now and i've not installed them on my teeth i want to do that but i want to whiten my teeth first i feel like it will look so good on my teeth be so guy I feel like it looks so so good you guys should we do it in this vlog or next week 
I said I want to whiten my teeth, so yeah, it has to be another time. Maybe the day that you know, teeth whitening actually doesn't take so long. So maybe the day that I whiten my teeth is the same day that I'm going to um, do the ear irrigation because I wouldn't want to go out and then come in and then go out again. I need to edit a little bit this evening. 